WFE opened the doors of Kennedy Theater today. Pamela Young got to see what goes on behind the scenes of their theatrical productions. For in that sleep of death, what dreams may come when we have shuffled off this mortal coil must give us pause. And we must give pause, say the folks at Kennedy Theater, to ponder the hours of work that go into each production. Today's open house, sponsored by the Friends of Kennedy Theater, allowed visitors to experience the real drama behind the scenes. Brevity may be the soul of wit, but there's nothing brief about the effort that goes into learning one's part. And all souls are not fashioned, I'm afraid, of the stuff of which philosophers are made. But there's more to mortal beings than what they uttereth, says Shakespeare. Apparel oft proclaims the man. The costume designers and sewers at Kennedy are busy with the upcoming production of Hamlet. And it was a great opportunity for visitors to play the part with a rummage sale of old costumes. And it's kind of neat because it's um, a community effort in the sense of the, th the theater people all pull together to make this show, every show, be a success. And then they all work hard for a common goal, from, you know, the lighting person to light the whole thing, and it works for it. The public was also treated to a workshop in puppet making, hula staging, and modern dance at the UH Lab Theater. All the world's a stage, but there's still a lot of work in creating the sets in this theater. The drama department is hoping donations and proceeds from a sale of t-shirts will further UH to continue its fine program in the dramatic arts. And for students, the open house was an opportunity to be recognized. Quality of mercy is not strained. <laughs> in other words, you don't do it by halves, right? You, you give yourself over to it entirely. The department would like the community to throw its support behind the students by a healthy attendance at each performance, for that really will determine whether the Kennedy Theater productions are to be or not to be. Pamela Young, Channel 2 News. And Jack Weirs has a report on what was and was not in sports. Yes, we're going to run down all the uh, NFL football scores.